Okay, new code is that. Let me put it in. And so this this is a fun deck. This this deck I actually built uh, after I got Dracula. I think Dracula is a really fun card. Um, there's a lot of ways this. There's a lot of things that could go wrong, but it when things go right, you can put up some crazy numbers, and you can just fill the entire board here with uh, with cards. So. That can be pretty fun. We're, we're gonna start with Morbius here. Uh, although, hey Flaming, I don't know if you're connected still to the chat, so maybe I should, maybe I shouldn't telegraph my moves as much. I don't know. <laughs> uh, okay, let's start with. Ooh, start with this for now. Actually, the peak is not great for me, to be totally honest. It's good for it's good for Dracula, but that's about the only card that it's good for. Halcow now is a six cost card. Oh wow, we both pulled Killmonger there. We we're gonna play Colleen here. Colleen is ooh. We might end up discarding Collector. Uh, yikes. Okay, maybe we gotta play Collector first. I'm thinking we gotta play Collector first. Ooh, he's got the Winter Soldier on the board. Bucky Barnes. What has Hydra done to him? Okay, um... Colleen next. This is kind of tricky here at the peak. The peak really was a kind of a monkey wrench. Okay. Okay. Interesting. All right. This is this is this is tough. Um, I think we're gonna go with this. This will guarantee that whatever we pull here with Dracula uh, would be... That would just get us there. Not by much, though. Eh, I don't know. This is kind of like a 50-50 here. The peak really kind of screwed us. Oh, yeah, we lost. I'm pretty sure we lost here. Oh, actually, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. We'll get a 12 here with Dracula. Okay, cool. Wow, that really came down to the last couple of turns. Victory. That really... Oof. GG on that one. Um... So, I discarded, I, I, I didn't want Swarm in my hand there because the problem with Swarm is you don't want Dracula to, Dracula to pull Swarm. If Dracula pulls Swarm, you get a three. So Dracula only becomes a three. If Dracula pulls Apocalypse, Apocalypse gets this initial uh, boost here. So he goes from an eight to a 12. Um, and so Dracula, whatever he becomes, that's what Dracula becomes. So. Um, he's one of those variable cards that you kind of have to play in the right situation, you know? Ooh, okay. Okay, let's play it. I am gonna just keep on playing for now. Ooh. Alright, Killmonger. Started off here. All cards must be played here on turn five. Okay. And then let's put Morbius in the middle. Ooh, swapping out the Nova with the Shang Chi. Okay, I didn't know you had a Shang Chi, but now I know. I did not know before, but now I know. I think we start here with 
Dracula. And then we've got to play turn. We got to play our cards here this turn. Yikes! Maybe I, I might have stacked that lane a little bit too much. Ooh, Gamora caught me. Caught me there. Well, what we really need here is a Modok. If I don't, uh, Hellcow or Modok would be. Yeah. That's not ideal. It's not ideal. Um. We could discard Wolverine and Swarm, maybe. Mm. I think I gotta get Swarm out of my hand. Ugh. Okay, maybe we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. I gotta get Swarm out of my hand. We'll discard two cards. Although, actually, scratch that, scratch that. Here's what we gotta do here. Ooh, actually, yeah, let's do, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. This discards Wolverine and Moon, Moon Knight. That guarantees us that we pull a 12 for Dracula. I think that's what we gotta do. It also powers up Morbius quite a bit. Hopefully Wolverine doesn't jump into Atlantis here, but you know, that's that's one of the risks you take. Or we can do that. Let's let's do that. Let's do that. Oh. Okay, so we're discarding uh, Moon Knight. Perfect. Now we're guaranteed. Oh. gonna be a little, I think I'm gonna be a little short here oh wait actually the discard works well we're gonna win here with Morbius because basically quantum quantum allowed us to discard a bunch of cards that we otherwise would not have been able to get okay so we didn't get the middle here but we did get these other cards so these are the cards we were waiting for we kept waiting for them and they finally showed up they finally showed up at the end of the game so hey I mean, all things considered, not too bad. All right. Um, probably Colleen, turn two. That's what I'm. That's what I'm leaning towards, at least at the moment. Uh, I'm gonna drop Collector first. We'll drop Colleen next turn. Moon Knight. Okay, let's see who we discard here. Ooh, I didn't see the Spider Woman yet. That's she's new. All right, Wolverine's a good pull. Ooh, I can't play Colleen. She's gonna discard Modok. Okay, we got. Uh, I'm gonna have to skip a turn here. Cause Modok is like one of those cards you really you really want to keep and really hold on to till the end. And I can't, I can't risk discarding her with Colleen. Ooh, okay, now we got... Well, we can play safely now, Colleen. We'll just get rid of that rock in our hand. Um, doesn't do too much for us, but... I mean, why not, right? And I guess we just play Modok. Yeah, I think we just play Modok here. That's what I'm that's what I'm thinking. That'll put some pressure um, on flaming to uh, to maybe play something with Namor, but if he does, he's gonna be losing uh, out on this ongoing ability here.
And so now this is kind of just a coin flip, right? You know, it's like, do I put it here? Or do I put it here? Those are really the two options. Um, we're down by Moritz Sakar. So I, I'm probably leaning towards Necrotia. Although we'll get a minus two. So we'll have nine, we'll be up by six. All right, let's play it. Oh, good catch. GG, flaming coming through. Flaming dropping the flaming sword. Dropping the flaming sword on us. Well played. All right, whoever uh, has more cards here gets plus 100. We got Mojo World here. The Nova. We will start with Colleen. Let's flip in Wolverine. Okay, we got two cards as well. And currently we have priority, but uh, we can't do anything on this turn, so we'll, we'll skip a turn for now. Powering up the Wolverine. I see you. Um, we'll we'll drop the Wong for now. Ooh, okay. I see you. Okay, you know what? We can't play here at Miniaturized Labs just yet. So, I think our... Oh, actually, I gotta actually do this first. I don't really have an option. I, I, I'm kind of forced to do this now. We're gonna lose out on Dracula, but... Um, it'll be worth it for the buff here. And then we'll get a bunch of free of that. I think uh, I think that's the best we can do. He might try to go for Mojo World, but if he does, that limits what he can kind of do in the other lanes. So I think uh, I think we're gonna finish with this and uh, feeling pretty good about this last turn. I just think it's like you can only win so many lanes, you know. So let's assume we've got Mojo, but oh, Wolverine might might not. Oh, all right, GG, Flaming Sword. Heck of a heck of a performance, man. Give it up. I gotta give it up for him. Let me let me drop that, drop that fist bump. GG. Very well played, my friend. Very well played. And there it is. Not too shabby. Oh, what's that? We got some free gold? I'll take it. All right. Well, GG. Trying to find me in a, new, uh, in a nice deck? Heck yeah, Wispy. Let me jump back into friendly battle. Um, should do you, you know what? I'm going to go with something a little bit different. I have been wanting to play this more. I recently have been uh, tweaking it a little bit. So I'm going to give it a try. This is my going to be my hella deck coming up. Or maybe I shouldn't say 
Maybe I should maybe I should pretend like I'm gonna play a couple different decks and then I'll decide. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just just uh you, you drop the code. Yeah, make a room make a room, uh drop the uh the number in the chat and I'll jump on in. I'd say this is my main deck, my on reveal. Uh, I do like that discard deck I played with a lot, though. I had Twitch open, but I swear I didn't sque uh, screen peek. I, I trust you, Flaming. It's all good, man. It's all good. Uh, I had to raise uh, that drop percentage. Totally understand. I totally get it. Okay, let me jump in here. Uh, let me go to join. And then... I'm, I'm gonna... I want to test this out. I'm gonna test out something a little different. Um, like you guys, I, I, I recently picked up Ghost Rider, so um, he was something I picked up this season as part of my uh, free uh, Series 3 card. Okay, you're going to mute. Okay, no worries. It's all good. Ooh. Destroying the... Oh, I, I wonder if you've got some kind of destroy deck going on. I wonder if you got some kind of destroy deck going on. That's what I'm thinking. I'm curious now. You, you've you've piqued my interest. I'm very curious. Oh, I am very curious now. All right, let's play it. I'm down. Ooh. All right, black cat he had in his hand. It is gone. So we saw the lizard, black cat. Ah, Mindscape, though. This is going to... That puts a monkey wrench in our plans. Mindscape. Okay. This is probably stupid, but I don't know. Oh. Okay, that's actually kind of perfect. Potentially. Potentially. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, oh, no. Okay, well, alrighty, alrighty. Well, it worked, it worked out, it worked out, but. Oh my gosh, okay, we're, okay, wow, wow. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. <laughs> Wispy dude, that 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 doc Ock, honestly, like oh man. That was tricky. I that could have that could have gone all sorts of which ways. <laughs> uh, that was that was a that was a fun play though. That doc Ock, man. He's one of those cards where like you either love Doc Ock or you hate him, depending on depending on if he helps you or not. Oh I, I gotta give it up for that. I love that play. These two cards together are real strong, just like Maw and Zero. Because what you're doing is you now for two energy, you played a 210 basically. You you played a 1-3 that gets rid of an ability, and then you you have a 1-7 where you can't play cards, that's the ongoing, but you get rid of that. So I gotta give it up to I gotta give it up, give it up for him. That is real strong. <clears throat> Here we got the lizard man. He's pretty much got that lane locked up, I would say. Potentially. Potentially. Uh we can play Lady Civ, but if we discard Hella, that is gonna put a little monkey wrench in our in our plan 
Ooh, okay. There we go. We got She-Hulk instead. Play Jubilee next. Oh man, it could be it could get a little tricky though if we pull. I'm trying to figure out a new deck. Uh, if you want to go again, yeah, sounds good, man. After this turn, I am so down. Let me just finish up with, with uh, King Wispy here. We'll see who takes the crown. Oh, okay, this is gonna be tricky. I was worried about that. I was I was a little bit worried about that. Okay. All we can really do is hope for Ghost Rider. If we don't get Ghost Rider, I think we're pretty much dead in the water. Uh, maybe I should have played at Throne Room. I don't know. Well, it's tricky. <clears throat> this is tricky. We did get Ghost Rider though, oh my god. So we've discarded four cards. <clears throat> uh, just to show you guys, we've discarded Hela, Odin, She-Hulk, and Infinite. So, I think our best bet is to play Ghost Rider. Hopefully, again, hopefully, we draw Hela. We may not. We could we it's it's a one in four chance, but we're at least guaranteed one of a couple of very big cards. So I think that's our best bet for now. We got Odin. He's gonna re-pull a card. Let's let's hope it's Hella. If it's Hella here, oh my gosh. Oh, it's She-Hulk. Okay. I still think we won here, though. Potentially, potentially. I don't know. I'll have to see. Oh, man, that was real close. That was super close. Let me. Uh, I can't. I can't reach the fist bump. All right. We're still in it, though. Okay, yeah, yeah, flaming. Sorry, we're still uh, we're doing uh, conquest, so we still got one more round. But uh, yeah, as soon, as soon as I'm done, I'll jump into that. Okay, let's see here. We got a couple of things we can we can play here. Okay, he's dropping the ebony. Okay, okay. Not bad, not bad. Oh, he's feeling confident. Okay. We'll play it for now, but I don't I don't know. I don't know. All right. What would he nullify here? Oh, Savage is going to be tough on him. We're going to start here with Lady Sif. Let's discard one of our big cards here. Oh, smart. Oh, so you can actually get around the Ebony Maw with Asteroid. That's that's interesting. I didn't even really consider that. But that's that's real smart. We're going to go Hell Cow next. Hoping we don't get rid of uh Okay, Odin's good. Abomination is good. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to do this just because, hmm. well, everything we've discarded is pretty big. Uh, hmm. I'm wondering if it's a better idea to make him keep the raptors, or is it a better idea to, I think it's actually a better idea to play Ghost Rider. We'll bring back either Infinite Odin or Abomination here. Okay. Ah, uh, that's too bad. Okay, that's fine though. Oh, actually Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider's over there. 
Mm. I think Wispy's got this one. I think I got a retreat here. Yeah, this is our final turn. I think I got a retreat here. Because we do not... We, we don't have Hela. Uh, Modok or Jubilee. I think I, got, I think I gotta get out of here. Give that up though. That was he played super well there. All right. Round four. Is it round four? What are we up? What, what are we up to here? Oh, also fun fact: I put a lizard last match uh, in my deck, so uh, you could see the cool lizard variant I got. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That 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 lizard was super cool. I like that variant a lot. I, I I'm digging a lot of the uh, the mech variants, and I'm I'm also digging a lot of the. Um, they have these like venom variants, like there's like a, like a scorpion venom variant that's super cool. All right, let's start here with Invisible Woman. We don't we don't have to play her, but she's an option. Ooh, he's a ten. That's a big daddy, big daddy maw. Ooh, okay, so this card actually worked out for us. Discount worked out for us. Um, we'll drop armor for now. Ooh, they got the black cat. Some big cards on the board already. I think we're gonna put the hell cow there. I haven't seen a Cosmo yet, so I'm I'm gonna assume there's no Cosmo. And it, considering there's no Cosmo, I don't know. It's just gonna be whether or not he can he can beat that hand. So he's at a 16, but we're going to beat that at least 16. Currently we have 20. This will be 26. I think we got a snap on it. And we'll see what happens. Oh! Victory! Oh, he knew. <laughs> All right, we're, in, we're at the high stakes now. High stakes match, let's go. Got, we got all of our massive cards in our hand right now. Uh, oh, Wispy, why are you doing this to me? Okay, um, whoa, uh, yeah, I guess we'll play it. Ooh. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do anything. I still, I literally, all of our giant cards are in our hand right now. All right, well that's, that's, okay. We can play She-Hulk now. Um, but I think it's more important to play Halcow first. I just get that, that sense. But he's got, a, he, that middle lane, man, he's pretty much got locked up. Okay. Okay. Well, we still got we still got Hella. We still got Hella. Oof. Okay. We'll see how this goes down. And then we got the Hella here. Um Okay, so we've only really gotten rid of Odin and Ghost Rider. Um, but we're going to get rid of one of our big cards here. I'm hoping it's infinite. It's either going to be infinite or She-Hulk. And then Ghost Rider will pull that into their lane. And I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Ooh. That's strong. That's definitely strong. Oh, oh man, okay. GG. 
Let me get that fist bump. He chose his moment well. All right, I think we're pretty much, are we tied up here? Okay, I'm up by a little bit. I'm up by just a little bit. Let's see. Skip this first turn. Got, oh, this is that lizard variant, huh? That's sick, man. I like that, I like that. All right, let's drop the invisible woman for now. We'll snap on this, just because we have Modoc. although we don't have Hela. I don't know, maybe, maybe that was kind of dumb. <laughs> I might, I might regret doing that. Hmm. I think we got to start with the Hell Cow and then the Modoc. Ooh, I love Warpath. I used to play with Warpath all the time. He's he's such a fun card because like, you know, you gotta win two out of three lanes, and it's fun like when you pick those two lanes and you just lean into them hard. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh no, and then the Ghost Rider. Oh no! Well, I don't know. <laughs> uh, we will see how it goes. We did not get Hella. We got armor instead. Uh, honestly, Jubilee would have even been better. But we will, we're gonna have to just work with what we got here. Oh! So if he can win this lane, then he'll win. But I think we got him. I think we got him beat by just a little bit. Sorry, I can't do the match. Leaving for golf. Hey, Flame Swords, no worries, man. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, hope you uh, you give the channel a follow, and we'll play again soon, man. GGS, yo. Let me let me give uh, King Wispy here a, a shout out, real quick, man. You played super good. Uh, King Wispy. I, I honestly, I was sweating hard. King Wispy. He's also got a, an awesome Twitch channel. So, uh, yeah, first game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, if you are not yet uh, subscribed to King Wispy, he's got a really fun channel. Plays some Marvel Snap. He's another Marvel Snapper. So, uh, when Doc f backfires... Dude, I literally... Oh man, you don't even know. I was waiting for Hella so hard, and I didn't get it. But then you you dropped the Doc Ock on me, and you pulled out like all my giant cards that were in my hand. You pulled out, I think, Infinite. Um, the Ghost Rider was the only card. <laughs> the Ghost Rider was the only card that I was like hoping to play later. But yeah, I think it was like Infinite uh, She Hulk. <laughs> Mis mistakes were made. <laughs> Oh, dude, that was epic, though. <laughs> that last game is um, how that combo is supposed to work. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Um, so, I mean, you know, it's like sometimes uh, sometimes the cards work out for you. Other times those, those same plays you would make uh, in a, you know, just depending on what's in, in your opponent's hand can totally backfire. But um, I'm not going to lie. I was having some fun there with this deck so i think we're just gonna jump into infinite for a little bit and we'll see how we do but oh man that was that was really fun thank thank you king wispy that was that was a lot of fun man i had a good time there <laughs>